Welcome back on this New Year's Eve. We were monitoring a cold front moving through Pennsylvania earlier this morning with a few rain and snow showers, but since we have seen that move offshore and now we're starting to see us drying out, especially as we go throughout our afternoon. Here's a look at Dallas at Misericordia University. You can see we just have the cloud cover to deal with here this morning and also we'll take you to Loganton out in Clinton County this morning. Temperatures still into the lower 30s here and still continuing with that cloud cover as we go throughout the afternoon. Here's a look at the radar. You can see we had some of those rain and snow showers earlier, which has since pushed off to the south and east, and now we're starting to slowly dry things up as we head throughout the afternoon hours. And that was all thanks to that cold front, which brought that round of some precipitation as we went throughout the morning hours. And now we have an area of high pressure building, and especially as we go throughout the rest of the afternoon, which will continue for tonight. So any New Year's Eve plans will look to be on the clear side. Here's a look at the temperatures across the board for us into the mid to upper 30s. Really haven't seen these budge too much since this morning. Currently 39 in Wilkes-Barre, Scranton. Good morning, Mount Pocono at 33. 34 for us in Hazleton and right now 37 currently in Williamsport. So New Year's Eve plans, like I mentioned, with high pressure building in. We're looking to stay clear. We're going to stay dry with a partly cloudy sky, but still on the chilly side tonight as lows are going to be dropping back into the lower to mid 20s. Here's future cast. You can see as we go throughout the rest of the afternoon, we have no weather concerns as high pressure builds back in. So I do think we will keep the cloud cover, maybe a few peaks of sun here and there for the afternoon, but for the most part, we'll have a mostly cloudy sky and for tonight looking good with a partly cloudy sky. Sky. Waking up tomorrow morning, no weather issues. We will have an increase in cloud cover. Then as we head throughout late tomorrow afternoon into the evening, this is when we start to see some of that icy wintry mix starting to build in. You can see especially in portions of the Poconos, the higher elevations across the northern tier and also out towards central Pennsylvania has the best chance of seeing any ice accumulations greater than a tenth of an inch into the valleys a little bit less, especially where it's a little bit warmer. We are going to continue with that wintry mix, but then changing over to plain rain, especially as we head into late Friday night into early Saturday morning, and then I think we're just left with the lingering rain shower as we go throughout Saturday, starting to slowly dry up as we go throughout Saturday afternoon. So here's a little recap for you. We are dry for New Year's Eve for the rest of the afternoon. That continues for tonight. Also for New Year's Day for tomorrow, we continue to stay dry, but then we're also looking for that icy wintry mix to arrive late afternoon into the evening. We will see that changing over to uh, rain as we head into the overnight hours and definitely want to be alert for those slick spots on untreated surfaces. Today with your eyewitness weather, Weather forecast those showers ending will have a mostly cloudy sky highs are reaching into the upper 30s to right around 40 for us and for tonight like I mentioned high pressure builds in will have a partly cloudy sky lows tonight are dropping into the lower to mid 20s here's a look at the seven day forecast you can see as after we head throughout Friday into Saturday we get a little bit of a break in the precipitation as we head into Saturday afternoon and then for Sunday we're watching a coastal system still the track with us a little bit uncertain but it looks like we will see a few rain and some snow showers temperatures right around 40. We're a little bit drier as we head into Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday. Highs will be into the lower to mid 40s. You can download the Eyewitness Weather app. Great to have with the interactive radar, especially with the wintry mix on its way. You can find more by visiting our website at pahomepage.com.